Yo, welcome back. The Steelers are in the playoffs, so it's only right to get a win with the Steelers. So, yeah, let's get straight into it. Um, okay, okay, okay. Ooh. God dang it, man. Why, why are you sliding, man? I can't do that. It's going to be a run. It's going to be a run. Please don't be. Oh, it is not a run. Yeah, okay. <laughs> boy. Zach TJ Watt. Oh. Oh, that's nope. hot. That's a killer weather. That's hot. Shot. All right. Let's see what we do. Chase in the middle. Oh, my God, bro. Chill out, man. That was. He was trying to chop my legs off. Ooh. Throw it to Najee. Dirt. Ooh. Najee. Oh. Oh, my God. Please get in there. Up the middle. Touchdown. Touchdown behind Kevin Dotson. That's TJ Watt right there, boys. No outside runs. Oh. Oh. Mine. Give me that. Camera sudden lurking. He lurking. Oh, man. Can I, can I get a little sticky? Oh, my God. Dog shit. Oh, my God. Oh my god. No! Okay. That's not it. That shit That's is not fucking it. trash. Sorry, sir. Skirt! Oh. oh my. That was a touchdown waiting to happen. That's a touchdown. Ooh, ooh, don't get caught. Please don't get caught. De De Deontay. De 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 Deontay Johnson. Touchdown. Get the. Oh. No, please don't get it anything. Hmm. Huh? Oh, if I was turned around. I would... Oh my god. If I was just turned around, that would have been another interception. Woohoo! Yeah, Chris boy. Warmly. Chris Warmly out here getting sex. That was my fault. My fault. Hey, Alex Highsmith. Everybody just getting a sack right now. Claypool. Claypool. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Drop that. Go, go. Give me that. Ooh. Turn around. Deontay. Okay. B oh. Whoa, come on, man. Never mind. Oh. Oh my god, man. That sucks. That sucks. Not good. I'm gonna throw the ball. It's another run. Oh my, no, please, please. Bro, get him down. Come on, man, dude, he's bumping off everybody. That's mine, bro, stop it, bro, come on. That, that's too obvious, too obvious, man, too obvious. Oh, let's go. Oh, oh, let's go. No, no, can't, don't get cat, don't get cat. No, I didn't want to do that. No, I wanted a little squirt. Oh, oh, hey, yo, yeah. Yeah. Little skirt. I meant. Oh my god. Dog shit. Squirt. Oh, nice running, bro. Let's go. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, first down. Uh-huh. Oh, yes, sir. First downs only. All right, that should be game. Um, Amazing game. We, I gave him most of the points. I did give him all the points. I was doing stupid passes, so. A close game, but it should have been as close as it should. So, yeah. All right, that's it for the game. Um, I'm going to put a, a prediction for the playoffs after this, so. 
yeah let's get straight into that all right so first game there's the uh bills versus uh patriots i say this will be a close game because bills versus patriots is always a close game but i'm gonna give the the bills the no, I'm gonna give the Patriots the slight edge. I think they're gonna win. It's gonna be like a low scoring game, like 17 to 14. I got Patriots going um to win that game. Whoops, not paint not Bills. Alright, next game, the Raiders versus uh Bengals. Um, I think this is gonna be like the highlight game of the wild card weekend. Um the Bengals, just like a I don't know, they could put like a whole like 40 points on you in the, at any time. They got Jamar Chase, they got T. Higgins, they got Tyler Boyd. They got um who else they got? They Burrow, Mixon. I don't know. That the whole offense on offense is like so sick to play. Yeah, as a Steelers fan, seeing that like twice a year, you can see that the team is dangerous. And I don't think the Raiders have enough uh firepower to compete with the Bengals offense. So I'm gonna say it's gonna be like 35-14 Bengals. It might be a little biased, but I don't care. I say the Steelers are gonna be the Chiefs. I'm gonna bet on that. It's gonna be like, it's gonna be, I'm gonna say 26 24. The, the Steelers played them once, they see what they can do, and then uh, this time they're gonna beat them. So I'm gonna say Steelers gonna beat over the, win over the Chiefs. All right, now we got the uh, 49ers versus Cowboys. I feel like the, the 49ers can pull off an upset, but I'm gonna say the Cowboys, they're either wishing, they're like either putting up like 40 points or the, they're underperforming. So, it depends like who comes into the game so i'm gonna say the 49ers are gonna win right now it's gonna be like a close game i'm say like 35 28 uh 49ers win trey lance gets his first dub his first playoff dub rams versus the cardinals let's say the uh the rams the cardinals have enough firepower to play with the well the cardinals do have enough firepower to play with the, um the rams but the, i think that's the rams is a more well-rounded team than the Cardinals. Um, but I'm still going with the Cardinals, just cause I have a gut feeling that the Cardinals are gonna win that game. It's gonna be like, it's gonna be like 28 to 21 Cardinals. All right, now we're on the divisional round. Um, this is where I see the uh, the Steelers losing now. The Titans are just too big. Of, well, we did beat the Titans the first time, but they didn't have Derrick Henry back, and I don't feel like we can beat Derrick Henry. Or, our run game is too sloppy and too wishy-washy at that time. So I'm going to say that the Titans win like 35-10. All right, now it's the Bengals versus Patriots. And this is where I say coaching is going to be uh, play a big hand in this. I think just having Bill Belichick have that playoff experience is going to elevate the Patriots over the Bengals. It's going to be a tough game. I'm going to say it's, it's going to be a low-scoring game going to be like the 17 to 10 with the uh Patriots coming out on top all right next the 49ers versus Packers let's see uh I don't see the Packers losing this game the 49ers are a good team but they're not good enough to beat the the MVP I say in the league all right next the uh, Cardinals versus Buccaneers the Buccaneers are too big of a team even though they lost multiple wide receivers I just can't bet on pitting bet against uh Tom Brady Tom Brady it's been too successful over his years so i feel like he's gonna prevail the uh, buccaneers to the conference finals against the packers now we got the conference finals we got the titans patriots buccaneers packers which i kind i like this i like this right here titans patriots let's see i think the titans are with derrick henry if derrick henry's at 100 i'd say the titans win that game in the buccaneers versus packers game i'm gonna bet against tom brady um the MVP of the season. I'm gonna say it's Aaron Rodgers. Aaron Rodgers is on fire right now, and he's hungry for another uh, Super Bowl. So, and it's like the rematch from like last year. So the Packers are hungry right now, trying to get back into the Super Bowl, and I I think they get in the Super Bowl this year. Packers versus Titans. So the Titans do have Derrick Henry, but their offensive their uh, passing game is horrible, and I just think the Packers are just more of a vote. Like a, a complete, more complete team than the uh, Titans. If they, they shut down Derrick Henry, I feel like the Packers have the 100% uh, win. They, there's no way they can lose if they shut down Derrick Henry. Because you see what Ryan Tannehill has to do when he has to pass the ball. He's not the best player um, passer. So I'm going to say the 
Packers win 21-24. Packers win. Tell me what you think in the comments. Um, if you like it or not, or uh, you change anything. Yeah, so that's it for the video. Have a good day and peace.